It's always you. John Watson, you keep me right. Do you have a boyfriend? Which is fine, by the way. I know it's fine. No. What? So you've got a boyfriend? No. Right. OK. see some more oh god yes <laughs> Still cares. I'm not actually gay. Well, I am. Look at us both. You're a great boyfriend. Okay, that's good. I mean, I always thought I was great. Now, Sherlock Holmes is a very lucky man. Oh, Jeanette, please. No, I mean it. It's heartwarming. You'll do anything for him. <laughs> Don't make me compete with Sherlock Holmes. Ah, oh, damn it! You'll be fine in the morning. Just sleep. No, I'll be next door if you need me. Why would I need you? No reason at all. You look sad when you think he can't see you. I've met someone. <laughs> oh, lovely. Yeah, we're getting married. Well, I'm going to ask anyway. So soon enough to Sherlock? Mm, well, yes. What's his name? It's a woman. A woman? Yes, of course it's a woman. <laughs> you really have moved on, haven't you? Mrs. Hudson, how many times Sherlock was not my boyfriend? Live and let live. That's my motto. Listen to me. I am not gay. You ripping my clothes off in a darkened swimming pool, people might talk. Somebody loves you. Well, if I had to punch that face, I'd avoid your nose and teeth too. Being all mysterious with your cheekbones and turning your coat collar up so you look cool. I have to give this to Mycroft. It's the government's now. I couldn't even Please. Give it. Close your eyes. No, what? Why? Why? What are you doing? Take my hand. Now people will definitely talk. On the house for you and for your date. Do you want to eat? I'm not his date. I need to get some air. We're going out tonight. Actually, I've uh, got a date. What? To where two people who like each other go out and have fun. That's what I was suggesting. Get a candle for the table. It's more romantic. I'm not his date. There's another bedroom upstairs if you've been needing two bedrooms. Of course we'll be needing two. Oh, don't worry. There's all sorts around here. Mrs. Turner next door's got married. Bachelor John Watson. What the hat is it? Anyway? Bachelor. What the hell are they implying? Still hanging around him. Yeah. Well. Uh, it's a tract, I suppose. No, we're not. Hey, sorry, we couldn't do a double room for you boys. That's fine. We're, we're not. And since yesterday, you've moved in with him, and now you're solving crimes together. Might we expect a happy announcement by the end of the week? You and John Watson, just platonic. Could I put you down for a no there as well? Frequently seen in the company of Stop Bachelor John with that. Confirmed Bachelor John Watson. Some death frisbee. Okay, this is too much. We need to be more careful. That was the most ridiculous thing I've ever done. And you invaded Afghanistan. <laughs> <laughs> that wasn't just me. <laughs> you two had a little domestic. Beautiful, isn't it? You're not so bad. Could you put something on, please? Hamish. <clears throat> John Hamish Watson. Just if you were looking for baby names. I had a tea too in the palace, if anyone's interested. So she's alive then. How are we feeling about that? Happy New Year, John. Do you think you'll be seeing her again? I wish you weren't 
whatever it is you are. Oh, John, hi. How are you? Morning. <laughs> yes, you have. Sorry, what? You have a girlfriend. What? Yes, yes, I'm going out with Janine. I thought that was fairly obvious. Yes, well, yes. <clears throat> You're going to have to tell me where you were last night. Working. Working, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Great, yeah. Unless I meet someone prettier. I'm Sherlock. Uh, hi. Hello. I was looking at naked women. I borrowed John's laptop. So that's him. This is Major Schulte and you. Uh huh. They're such good friends. Why does he barely even mention him? He mentions him all the time to me. He never shuts up about him. About him? Mm -hmm. It's definitely him that he talks about. Mm -hmm. Very. John says he's the most unsociable man he's ever met. He is. He's the most unsociable. Mm. Ah, that's why he's bouncing around him like a puppy. <gasps> oh, Sherlock. Neither of us were the first, you know. Uh, just the bride and groom, please. Sherlock. Oh, sorry. John and Mary. Domestic bliss. No, no, no. I prefer to think of it as the beginning of a new chapter. What? Nothing. I have that silence. What? Sherlock, they get married. I warned you. Don't get involved. We can't all three dance. There are limits. Yes, there are. Mm -hmm. Involved, I'm not involved. No. <laughs> You're right. John asked me to be his best man. How could I say no? Absolutely. Not involved. I believe you. Really, I do. Enjoy not getting involved, Sherlock. I remember she left early. I mean, who leaves a wedding early? Because you chose her. I will burn the heart out of you. I have been reliably informed that I don't have one. But we both know that's not quite true. Well, you know, you've got John. John, there's something I should say. I've meant to say always, and I never have. Since it's unlikely we'll ever meet again, I might as well say it now. Sherlock is actually a girl's name.